Yeah. It's number two, you should use an emergency telephone and call for help. Park as far to the left as you can and then leave the vehicle by the passenger door and find the nearest emergency telephone. Top tip for finding the nearest SOS phone, on a motorway there are distance marker posts and they'll have an arrow one way or the other and that shows the direction to the nearest telephone. I would not recommend doing what the guy in this clip did, looks pretty dangerous to me. It's number two, stop at the nearest service area. If that's too far away, leave the motorway at the next exit and find a safe place to rest. You should definitely not stop on the hard shoulder to rest on a motorway or any of the other insane suggestions on these answers. Yes, these are real theory test questions. It's number two again, face the oncoming traffic because it will be passing you at high speed. If the draft from a big lorry catches you by surprise, it might blow you off balance and onto the carriageway. Don't want that. It's number one, you need to look much further ahead than you do on other roads. If there's a problem or a hazard ahead, then you'll have more time to react to it. It's number three to help you fit safely into traffic flow in the left hand lane. When you join the motorway, try and join without affecting the traffic in the left lane so making good full use of the slip road can help you fit into the best gap possible in that traffic. It's number two, they are red. There's lots of questions that pop up on a theory test about what color the studs are on a motorway. So, learn them.
It's number three. Vehicles towing a trailer aren't allowed in the third lane of a three lane motorway. They're restricted to 60 miles an hour only. So if you're towing a trailer, it's overtaking in lane two only. This one's pretty easy, it's number one. The only time you should stop on a motorway is in an emergency or if you're broken down. Anything else, find the next service area and stop off there. Or in an emergency, leave at the next exit, find a good place to park up and get the phone call done then. Last question, this one's number three. Other things that might come up on your theory test that can't use a motorway are pedestrians, cyclists, motorbikes under 50cc, powered wheelchairs, and mobility scooters.